Hi, in this video I want to show you this massager. I've been using this quite a bit and it works fantastic. So to turn it on you just press this button here and that's what it does. And I mainly use it on my lower back and these things here they basically massage you. Notice it's red, that's because the heat is on. In order to turn the heat off you have to press the button and now the heat is off. And then to turn the heat back on you press the button again. One thing that is a little bit annoying, but not really, I've gotten used to it by now, is in order to turn it off, you actually have to hold the button down to turn it off. So if you hold it, it turns off. And then if you press the button again, it turns on. So it basically has two settings, one with heat, one without heat. I'll go ahead and turn it off. Okay, let me show you some other things regarding this massager. The extension cord is fairly long. However, if you are going to be needing one that's longer, then this won't work for you. For example, if you're watching TV and maybe the outlet is really, really far away. However, for my case, uh, it's pretty good. Something else worth mentioning is this little connection here. When I first got it, I was doing it incorrectly. Um, it comes with this here, which tells you that you have to push this in all the way. So let me show you what I'm talking about. So if you just do this and connect it, it'll actually still turn on. Even though, even though it's not fully connected, right? Because look, look what happens. You see that? So when you, when you close this, you have to just basically push until it snaps. So snap, okay? It even tells you here, uh, it warns you about how you need to push it until it snaps. So apparently I'm not the only one who encountered this issue and it's really good that they included this tag. I recommend leaving it on and it looks like mine's falling off, but um, very, very important to close it all the way. And it's not a big deal. It's just, if you don't do it, like if you don't make it snap, what'll happen is it'll continually come loose, which is really annoying. The brand on this one is Zillion. So far, I'm really happy with my purchase. My only regret is not buying it sooner. So if you're looking for a really good massager that will work your back, and yeah, it just it massages you really good. I like it. Good luck.